Teens. In the movie! Hi, I'm Corey. And I'm Colin. And welcome to Two Teens. And the movie. The movie that we'll be reviewing today is... The, the Avengers! Avengers! Today, we're here to review what may be the biggest superhero movie of this decade or any decade. And that's why we went to the midnight debut of The Avengers! Crossing the worlds of Iron Man, the Hulk, Four and Captain America, Marvel Studios brings us a summer spectacular. The Avengers is an ultra action-packed superhero movie. The story is about the exiled and evil half-brother of Thor, Loki, who comes to the Earth and steals an endless energy source known as the Tesseract. Samuel L. Jackson is Nick Fury, the head of S.H.I.E.L.D a covert government agency in charge of a top-secret program called the Avengers Initiative. The Initiative brings together a team of superheroes to combat against a threat that will destroy Earth. The problem is these superheroes have always operated solo, especially Tony Stark, a.k.a. Iron Man. But the heroes must put aside their differences and they hope to stop the evil Loki and his army from conquering Earth. Seeing many of your favorite superheroes together on one movie promises to be a thrilling ride. There was an idea to bring together a group of remarkable people. So when we needed them, they could fight the battles that we never could. It's your turn to talk about what you didn't like about the movie. No, I think it's your turn. Well, I've done the last few. But to be honest with you, there is nothing that I did not like about this film. Corey, I gotta agree with you. There was nothing that I didn't like about this film. But I'll tell you what I liked about the film. The action was fast-paced, captivating, and intense. The special effects were fantastic. And the movie was so... Fast, a two hour and 20 minute film felt like a 90 minute film. I especially loved how the actors nailed their superhero roles, especially Robert Downey Jr. as Tony Stark aka Iron Man, who stole almost every single scene that he was in. If you don't fall over laughing from this um, great comedy from him, you're probably asleep. No offense, but I don't play well with others. Big man in a suit of armor. Take that away, what are you? Uh, genius. Billionaire playboy philanthropist. <laughs> the only thing I'll add to your acting comments is Scarlett Johansson did an excellent job as Black Widow and kicked everybody's butts. And speaking of kicking butt, there is one parental concern. The intense but bloodless violence makes it so that we recommend this film for ages 10 and up. And we are happy to inform that there is little swearing. Now here comes the part that you've all been waiting for, but I think you're not going to be surprised by our grades. I give this film an A. I also gave this film an A. Over the past few decades, there have been countless movies about the lives of superheroes. Just to name a few, Spider-Man, Batman, and Superman. What the Avengers does is it takes a whole new set of superheroes and gets the best of all of them and makes it into one thrilling, action-packed movie. I'm a fan of the Iron Man movies and Captain America, but when you throw in the Incredible Hulk, Thor, Black Widow, and the new character called Hawkeye, it creates one great recipe for spectacular. So from two teens and a movie, we'll, we'll see, see you next time! Gee.